Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel and today we are going to talk about the iPhone 7 smart battery case. Alright, let's start out with the pros. There's a lot, there's a quite a few pros as far as this case. Um, it's not a bad case, it's a really good one. Very solid one. Um, but let's start out with the pros. Upgraded battery. So with the iPhone 6s battery case, um, it pretty much was an 1877 milliamp hour battery. Um, this year, they pretty much upgraded 25% um, more battery inside of it to 2385. And I definitely noticed it, okay? You definitely notice a difference if you ever use the 6S smart battery case. You will definitely know a difference with the 7, definitely, okay? Here's another pro, design. Now, people may not agree with me on this. It's pretty much everybody's preference is different, but I definitely like the design of this case, okay? It was kind of weird, especially when the 6S first came out. I'm sorry, the 6 came out, and they came out with the, pretty much the 6 battery case. Um, people were making fun of the design as far as the little, you know, battery poking out. Um, I kind of like it. It's, like, really grippy as far as the material. Um... As far as where my hand rests, you know, it, it looks really good. It, it, I have something to lean on and stuff with my hand and my fingers. Um, this case pretty much prioritizes function over form. Okay, that's basically what I'm saying. All right, it's not about how it looks. It's about, you know, the functionality of it, of the design, which is the best part. Okay, it also adds a little bit of weight to the phone. Okay, that we all know the iPhone 7, the iPhone 6, and 6S were pretty much light phones. Um, but this adds heft to it. I don't like a light phone. I don't want to feel like I'm using a piece of paper. I want to feel like I'm using a damn phone. <laughs> you know? Um, next one. Charging. Now, it's pretty much as far as charging from 0 to 100. It's going to be the same thing as like using a, a 5 watt hour charger from the, you know, the regular Apple charger. But, as far as using it from 100% onwards, like say for instance you get up in the morning, okay, and you have your phone 100% and you just slap on the case and just go about your business throughout the day, this case will keep your phone at 100% for an extremely long time, okay? Me, personally, I watch Netflix, I go on Facebook, I go on Instagram, I go on every social networking site, I always answer texts on the fly. And I can say that this case has literally survived the whole day, all the way until about 8 o'clock at night, sometimes even 10, okay? Just the case. Not even the case is dead, all right? Um, so that's really good. That's really good. And that's why I'm saying that you'll definitely notice the battery difference from the 6S to the 7, okay? Next up, speaker grills. We all know that the iPhone has two speakers this year. Thank God, okay? So it has a top firing speaker, which is going to be a tweeter, and it has a bottom firing speaker, which is pretty much going to be your the loudest speaker. It's going to have the bass, everything. Okay. Now with the iPhone 7 smart battery case, it pretty much has two speaker grills right here. One of them doesn't mean anything because it's just there for aesthetic reasons. Okay. But the other speaker, it basically makes the bottom speaker a front facing speaker. So when you're listening to Netflix or YouTube or anything like that, it's going to get extremely loud, which I love. All right. I, I love some front facing speakers. All right. Gives a, you know, a, a more immersive experience, basically. Now, I know you guys think that I'm just talking about pros about this case, but there are some cons. Okay. There's no LED light indicator. None. Zero. Now, as people, you know, some people do know. The, the Mophie juice packs, they usually have pretty much the LED, four LED indicators on the back. Okay, to show how much battery life that the case itself has. Alright, this doesn't have it. Apple, they just pretty much put a LED. I don't know if you're ever going to see it or can see it. It's just one little LED light. just And you can't even see it on top of that. Um, to, show, to say that the phone is charging. But Apple remedied this as far as iOS 9 and iOS 10. Where they have a widget saying how much battery life the case has okay it's, it's okay it's a little remedy I've, i'd rather have them have the led indicators on the back so i can see how my case is doing as far as the battery is concerned but it's okay it's fine i can get over it i still know how much the battery the the battery of the case has so it's perfectly fine battery capacity is another con now i know that i said in the beginning that that was a pro but let me explain the reason why it's a con Okay, even though it's a small increment as far as upgrading 
from 1877 to 2385, it's still smaller than what you can get from other offerings, okay? So like I said, the Mophie Juice Pack, they some of them, even the, even the Plus, the Plus model, which is pretty much the, the bigger one that has a bigger battery inside of it, 3,000 milliamp hours, you know, you can get that, and that has way more, it's going to last way longer than pretty much the iPhone 7 smart battery case, okay? And then there's even other offerings that have 4,000 milliamp hours, and the list goes on and on, higher the milliamp hours goes. Um, so yeah, this it's not, the, it's not really that great as far as, you know, battery life is concerned for the case itself, but it's decent. It's, but you still can get way better offerings. Just saying. All right. <sighs> and conclusion. <laughs> Is it a good buy? Eh. I mean, considering the price, which is pretty much $100 plus tax if you get in the Apple website, you can get way better offerings. So, no. It is not a good buy. Not a good buy at all. Okay. Um, you can definitely go with the Mophie Juice Pack. Um, Air or the plus and it will definitely do you just fine and the functionality as far as the LED lights It's way better than just one LED light or a widget Okay, you know how much you're getting as far as how much you have as far as the battery case And plus on top of that is gonna keep your phone charged for the whole day if you unless you use your phone like like crazy Okay, so That's pretty much my review of the battery case I still like it, but like I said, for you guys, unless you guys like Apple like I do, there's other offerings that are better than it. So, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.